What's up everyone? You got Aspirant Aircraft Maintenance Engineer Prakash here and today I'm very happy to share this positive video with you guys. Yes, Jet Airways is back into the aviation again. Soon the ATC controllers out there will hear the call Niner Whiskey from the skies. Obviously not from the skies, from the aircrafts or the Jet Airways. Yes guys, Jet Airways has revived itself after a pause of one year and more in the aviation and we will see Jet Airways aircrafts flying soon in the skies after all its aircrafts which has been leased or been owned by the Jet Airways will be re-registered and the AOC of the operator will be revalidated. This is the letter showing the bullet payment of 13 million dollar to Fleet Ireland the leaser of Jet Airways and has now taken full ownership of 6 Boeing 777-300 aircrafts plus 3 Boeing 737s under ownership and 3 A330-200 remains on the final lease agreement. So the question arises here is that the company running out of cash of how acquired this money, this much amount of money to clear its lease dues and own the aircrafts that is a total of 12 aircrafts now. The answer to the question is Jet has acquired the aircrafts from the funds raised by selling its office that is the primary office which was there in the Bandra Kurla complex Mumbai. The area put on for sale measures around 1,69,983 square feet saleable area and comes with a parking space of 140 cars according to the notice. The property, there is the two floors in the Godraj BKC area building of the Mumbai is being purchased by the Brookfield Asset Management Company with by giving rupees 490 crore. Let just look a year ago when Jet Airways shut down its operation on 19th April 2019 and all of its aircrafts were grounded. At that time, Jet Airways was having a fleet size of 123 aircrafts consisting of Boeing 777, Airbus A330, Boeing 737 and ATR aircrafts. Jet was grounded due to its unpaid lease and was soon taken by its leaser and the creditors to the NCLT that is National Company Law Tribunal. Earlier this week, Jet has also announced its Q4 that is flying a 2019's result and in its 80 page long result copy, it stated that Jet losses had increased significantly from a loss of Rs. 766 decimal 13 crore reported in flying year 2018 to a loss of 5535 decimal 75 crore in the flying year 2019 jet airways is one of the oldest private carrier of india meanwhile the creditors are waiting the resolution plan and two groups have submitted their bids for the jet airways bidding in group a a consortia named fstc that is Flight Simulator Technic Center based in Haryana has partnered with the Abu Dhabi based Imperial Capital Investments LLCs and the big charters based in Mumbai and plan to operate jet airways with only 5 to 10 airplanes on domestic only and want to invest 100 million dollar. In Group B, a UK based financial advisory company that is Calrock Capital and a UAE based entrepreneur that is Murari Lal Jalan and two ex fellows of Jet Airways that is Nikos Kardasis that is the ex CEO of Jet Airways and Mr. Naresh Goel the owner of Jet Airways. They are planning to run Jet Airways with 15 to 20 aircrafts in their fleet size and will operate both domestic and international as well. The Mumbai branch of NCLT has put a deadline of August 31st for the completion of the bidding that is the CIRP of the Jet Airways. CIRP means Corporate Insolvency Resolution Process. This is a fascinating video of engine swap of Jet Airways Boeing 777 aircraft currently underway at Delhi airport 
In 2005, Jet has ordered General Electric 90-115 Bravo engine to power its 777-300 feet. The swap is to put the engines into the right aircraft. After cleaning, lease dues for these 12 aircraft's engineering work is in full swing on Jet's aircraft. One needs to realize and understand that airline world is highly capital in intensive gestation period are long and for the team to win in challenge it is not impossible but yet a task for sure best of faced big tides and Jet Airways is going through these times now. All the best to the team working for bringing best jet into the skies and get it into the first place. So what is the possibilities for its operation strategy? Number 1. Jet may initially operate for transporting cargo only and after this corona pandemic they may fully operate as a scheduled passenger airline. Number 2 possibility. Jet may operate initially for the repatriation flight because on 20 April 2020 Jet has applied for, to MOCA and DGCA saying to re-register their aircrafts and revalidate their AOC and give them permission for the repatriation flights and after grabbing some cash and getting some good market share jet may after that come into the market as a good scheduled operator as i'm sure you guys might be knowing that capital is the most important thing to run an airline now what may be the employment policy number one jet airways may give a call to its employees who are sitting idle in the home and hoping for the jet revival and can also give call to all those employers who have shifted to other companies after Jet Airways stopped their operation on 19th April 2019. Number 2 Possibility Jet may take a bold step and call an interview for the new employers and take the fresh batch of new employers into their company. Probably Jet may go with the first option only because this option seems to be very good for Jet Airways as the employers who has left the company will be more experienced and they are already experienced on the aircrafts which they, they are operating. But whatever may be, but this is a very good news for Indian aviation, all the aviators out there and also for the world's aviation market. With this thing, I enclose my video. I hope you guys got some knowledge from this video. And yaar, Jet Airways ke liye ek like to banta hai yaar. What do you think? Which company will beat Jet Airways? And which policy will be the best for the Jet Airways revival? Let me know in the comment section below. And yes, I do bring such knowledgeable, factful and informative videos in this channel if you like my work you can subscribe to the channel and press the notification bell icon so that you won't miss any of my upcoming videos jet airways is waiting for engineers pilots and other staffs to lift its wing quote for the video is bad time comes in everyone's life but who handles it calmly is the one who goes to the top jai hind